if I squeeze it, is it, how does it, sim is it more similar to the paper or styrofoam? Well, you do it. I want you to decide. It's not see-through, but sometimes you think about it, it's like, and it's durable. It's just conductor. Conductors. Some of them are conductors. Most of them but well, something I'm noticing is that some of them are. Well, those aren't really. Small, yeah, some of them. But they have. But they've got the air pockets. Can you tell me why that's important to know about how the atoms move? So you can see like how fast they move, and how like how slow you want your cup to you know like not get hot. So you want it to like so you want it as slow as possible. So you kind of did like the materials that we think. I always thought that metal cups would be the very best, but then I learned that metal is actually one of the worst because it's a conductor and it conducts energy crazily. I think, yeah, I agree with felt being the worst performer because I mean, it has no air bubbles. Okay, which one should we do? Gavin, let's do that plastic. Now. Plastic? Okay. I think this clear plastic. I think it would plastic. be a worse performer because, yeah, because it's, it's clear, clear and, and very like thin. the light will go right through it. Yeah. Yeah. So we'll put that in worst performer. So plastic cup. Can you tell me why metal is a good conductor and why it didn't keep your liquids cold? Can you explain that a little bit? It's kind. It's a solid, and solids the atoms are like <coughs> like this, and so the heat can instantly just travel through the atoms, mm -hmm. like one to another. It looks like paper laid on top of each other if you look really closely. It just looks like layers of paper. Yeah, but layers it of paper. Looks but if you look super closely where it's cut, look, it's like fibers. Yeah. Sometimes if we don't agree, we, we each go like, and maybe in study hall we'll look up certain facts about things and we can try to prove the other person. Like, it's not a little debate. And then eventually, sometimes if people that are like disagree or don't know, um, they don't exactly get it quite yet. And so you kind of want to show them facts. And so I did that one.